Okay, in operations, we have incidents and we have to manage them. Or we have events and we have to manage them. And the systems have events and incidents and we have to manage them. And so we have a whole crowd of acronyms here. S-I-M-S-E-M-S-E-I-M. System, event, and incident management by any other acronym. Uh, so, what is this doing for us? Um, well, it's, it's managing the problems. I mean, you know, we have problems. Let's, let's manage them properly here. Uh, do the right thing in, in fixing the problem. Um, make sure that you are fixing the problem, the whole problem, and nothing but the problem, so that you don't create another problem by fixing a problem that doesn't exist, or uh, doing something extra that just complicates matters and therefore uh, makes it more likely that we're going to make a mistake. Um, all of this is a, a control, um, but the control is a, a process. So it's sort of a control process here. Um, we, uh, th there is a, a lot of relation here with audit logs, event logs, auditing in general. Um, uh, I mean, you know, we've, uh, we've got event logs and we've got incident logs. Uh, so we are then managing the events and the incidents to see whether or not they, they do uh, portend a problem or just a mistake that somebody made. Uh, well, it's still a problem. It's got to be fixed. Um, so um, everything that we have talked about in terms of logs uh, we are you know, it is going to be applicable in terms of event management system event and incident management and we're going to we're going to look more at incident management in um, law and investigation and ethics because Investigation is very often investigation of an event or an incident. Um, incident response is another uh, uh, issue. And, and we've talked about business continuity planning. Um, incident response planning follows a, a very, very similar pattern. As a matter of fact, when I do... Uh, the presentation on, uh, you know, sort of my one-page presentation on uh, business continuity planning, there is a, another uh, one-page uh, uh, presentation on incident response planning. So, you know, planning for these incidents and how we're going to manage them is important. But at this point, we're talking about the tools um, that people have uh, prepared for you, um, hopefully with the uh, objective of making your handling of incidents uh, easier and more effective. Um, we, uh, well, you know, anything for a quiet life, uh, so anything that makes your life easier, but you know, do remember, this is, you know, somebody is going to sell you this, you know, this will make your life easier, you know, will it in fact make your life easier? Will it cover everything? Is it going to make your life easier but miss a few things which is going to make your life more difficult later on? So, uh, you know, be, be careful. Caveat emptor comes into play in a big way here. Uh, we want to make sure uh, that the system event incident management uh, platform that we have purchased does in fact work for us and, and does uh, 
not only what we want it to, but what uh, we need it to in, in terms of protecting the enterprise. So, uh, so it's going to report on events and incidents, uh, track uh, related events and incidents, hopefully. Uh, hopefully resolve problems affecting the system. Um, one of the things that we want to, the system to assist us to do is to identify different types of problems. You know, is this an error? Is this a problem with our policy? Is this an attack uh, specifically against us? Um, so, uh, a, uh, you know, there, there are going to be various things that uh, are specific to our systems, and uh, some, uh, you know, updates to our systems are going to require um, uh, new um, permissions, authorizations, um, and tools, or at least functions of the tools. And so, again, your, you know, one size does not fit all in incident and event management. Um, you are going to have to ensure that if you get into additional uh, business functions, that um, your system event management software has the capability to look at those functions and, and manage those functions as well. Uh, so, uh, be aware of that, be careful, um, uh, and again, you know, everything that we've talked about in terms of auditing, um, a, a lot of the things that we've talked about in terms of change management um, are going to be applicable here and make sure that uh, we have the right thing and we do the right thing with it.